Hi all and welcome to my little creation corner. If you guys don't already know me from previous D&D videos, my name is Dakota and today I wanted to talk about my character, Quillith. Quillith is a tiefling rogue and for some people that don't quite know these terms yet, I'm just going to go over the fundamentals of what these characters actually are. A tiefling is a humanoid species that descended from demons, devils, deities, a lot of different kind of replicas of that and it essentially breeded with humans. While a lot of tieflings are depicted to have an evil nature, this isn't necessarily true. It really does come down to how you want to create your character, but this also does come from their overall appearance. A lot of tieflings come with uh, horns, tails, uh, very intimidating gazes and um, dramatic skin colors. Um, this can also vary as well, but it really does depend on how you want to create your character. Whether you want a more chaotic, lawful character or a lawful neutral, such as Quillith, um, it really does come down to what you want to create your character. As for rogues, this class is actually quite self-explanatory, but to give you a little idea of what they actually do, so they are, to me personally, they are seen as an assassin based class. Um, they use a lot of versatile characteristics that do apply to your character and they have very um, stealthy combat skills um, and abilities on the playing field. When creating this character I looked at a lot of resources but the one resource that I found um, that all D&D players will actually know. Um, it's called D&D Beyond, a brilliant website that can help you in gameplay, exploration and even character development. Um, be sure to go check it out if you are interested, but yeah, that is the resource that I use. For Quillis design, I really wanted to hone in in that intimidating yet mysterious kind of flow. I really wanted to make sure that she had a lot of um, interest in people, but also in the story, she was able to create a lot of questions that others would ask her. Quillis attire, I really wanted to keep loyal to the medieval era that our campaign is currently playing. So during the adventure, you will see Quillis, um, you know, upgrade to a lot of like leather harnesses, capes, um, accessories. Um, in general, her class is known to have a lot of different accessories and items on her that are quite small, so a lot of pockets and um, add-ons are necessary in a way. So Quilla's personality um, is very depicted from her past. She has very um, disciplined mannerism just because of her ex-military experience. I won't go too much into detail just because that will be discovered throughout the campaign and gameplay. And I also don't want the people that are going to join our play, obviously, spoilers because that would be horrible. The most important aspects that I wanted to incorporate with Quillith was the overall character development. I feel like the character development for this character is so crucial um, when it comes to the campaign and the overall story. So because of her traumatic experiences, um, being an ex-military soldier and a lot more that will not be revealed. Um, I really wanted to make sure that she was able to develop throughout the whole campaign and even um, change her perspective on various characters. So throughout the campaign you will meet many different characters um, and many different personalities. So you will see Quillis react very differently to these different characters which I'm very excited for and it's going to be very unpredictable when it comes to the gameplay, the situation and even the DM at times. So the characters that are going to be introduced in this campaign are going to vary in so many different ways. Whether it's characteristics, overall visuals or even just the interaction between Quillith, um, it's going to be very interesting. So what I'm very keen for is a few specific characters and how that they're going to correlate or even um, develop throughout the story. But overall, I really do hope that people take a liking to Quillith. She is my first D&D character and there are a lot of different situations that I am not used to. When it comes to D&D being just limitless in basically anything. Um, so it's definitely a challenge for new people such as myself and even some of my other friends that are in this campaign. But I'm really excited to see where Quillith will go and how she will develop. But overall, I do hope that you guys have enjoyed this video. This is one of my very first intro videos about D&D and I'm very happy to do more. Um, I have left a few links down below if you do want to check them out. But overall, I do hope you guys have a good time and enjoy our videos. So, bye! Okay. What are you doing? No! Shine! <laughs>
That's stopper. Design. I meant development. <laughs> Fuck. Sorry. <laughs> you freaking me out. <laughs>